Yo, what is up guys, Straight Face Section Nerd here, and today I'm gonna tell you the story of when I cussed out my mom. Yep. Yeah, I was stupid. It was eighth grade. Don't judge me. I did stupid things. It didn't end well for me, I'll put it to you like that. Alright, so it was hmm, I don't know what day it was, but it was a school day. We was out uh, no no no, it was the weekend, because we was out all day. We was out all day, we went to the mall, and then we went to Walmart for shopping, and then we went to Little Caesars. And when, the, when we got down with the mall, I texted my friends, I'm like, hey guys, I'll be on Xbox soon, uh, what do you guys want to play? And they're like, oh, let's play Black Ops 2, just get on soon. So I'm like, alright, I'll get on soon. Uh, we got, after, we was at the Walmart for a couple, or mall for a couple hours, we left the mall, we went to Walmart, and I'm like, hey guys, we're at Walmart food shop, and then I'll be home. Like, all right, all right, you, you nerd delay, but you know, it's whatever. We didn't care. Oh well, stuff happens. We get it, delays, blah, 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 blah. So we went from uh, Walmart to Little Caesars. I don't know if we went anywhere else before that. Went from Walmart to Little Caesars. Uh, and I said, Mom, are we going home after this? She's like, No, we got weird places to go. So I'm like, God dang it. So I walked out of Little Caesars and I texted my friends. I'm like, Hey guys, my mom's being an itch. I T C H. I T C H. I didn't cuss. I said I T C H. But you, you know, apparently to her, that's cussing. So she went freaking grade A ballistic. She read my phone and she's like, Oh my god, you caught me a biatch and a bunch of stuff. And I'm like, No, I didn't. I said itch. You're being an itch. A pain in my itch. But you know, you kind of had to go ballistic. <laughs> and this, I, I was just dying laughing. She made me give her my phone and my iPod because I had a little slide phone back then. Wasn't anything. My iPod had all my stuff on it. So she took both of those, and uh, everything was awkward the rest of that day. So I went home and just played my Xbox. Didn't get in trouble at all. I went to school, or my mom drove me. She she was really pissed at me, so she drove me. Cause I, at this time I didn't ride a bus. Cause my middle school didn't have a bus to come where I went, or where I lived. So she drove me to where she knew a bus stop was. Turns out that wasn't a bus stop for my school. That was for high school, which I was going to next year, which is where I'm at right now. And yeah, long and. We waited, it didn't come, she's just like, okay, I'll just drive you to school. So it was really awkward, because we weren't saying anything to each other, we were just quiet. So all day at Xbox, or all day at school on Xbox, all day at school I was saying, hey guys, I, I kind of cussed out, my mom cussed out with parentheses, per, quotation marks around it, saying, hey guys, I cussed out my mom, and they're like, oh, what happened? Like, I just got my phone taken, my iPod, they're like, alright, that's fine. Like, you want to play Xbox today? Yeah, I'll be on Black Ops 2. I'll be on Black Ops 2. After what just happened, I'll be on Black Ops 2. So, I felt bad all day for doing it. I came home. I said, I didn't even walk in. I just walked in the door. My mom was sitting on the couch. I said, Mom, I'm sorry about what happened. Blah, 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 and a bunch of stuff. I just apologized. She's like, alright, that's fine. And I went in my room, and I sat down. I grabbed my Xbox controller. Went to turn on my Xbox. <laughs> it's not there. I said, Mom, where's my Xbox? She's like, oh, I took it out and I sold it. You sold my freaking Xbox. Yeah, because you kind of called me a biatch. And I said, no, I called you an itch. She's like, no, same thing. <laughs> and at this point, what was going through my head, I said, yeah, now you really are being one. <laughs> and I uh... I was mad all day. Dinner was done. They're like, get in here and eat. I said, no, screw that. And I just sat in my room, stared at my TV, and watched TV because I was pissed. I was punching stuff, throwing stuff. Dude, I was beyond pissed because they sold my own Xbox that I bought with my own money. <laughs> I was pissed, dude. You don't even know. But, uh, they took everything, they sold it all, and I never got it back at that time. They literally sold it. Sold it. Gone. Completely. Uh, I think it was... 
uh, halfway through my freshman year in high school, my mom's like, hey, you want your Xbox back? And I'm like, it's not going to be the original one. She's like, well, I kind of sold it to a family member, and their and their kid got in trouble, and they can't have their Xbox, so you want it back. And I'm like, oh, frick, yes, give my Xbox back. So they gave my Xbox back, and I was happy. Got my Xbox back. I had all my games except for... I think Halo Wars was the only game I didn't have back. I had I had a bunch of games. Everything was on it, saved data, everything. They didn't they didn't touch my account. I was really surprised. Maybe they used it for DVD player. I don't freaking know. People are stupid with that. But uh, I got it back, and now I'm selling it. Me personally, I'm selling it for like 150. All the games and all that. I'm selling it to my aunt. Uh, yeah. Um. Uh, hasn't been sold yet, but I'm still doing Condemned, by the way. I, just, I still have that, but that's backwards compatible to the Xbox One, so that's what I'm doing. I'm keeping Skate 3, so when it turns backwards compatible, uh, yeah. I am, I, that was a good day for me. Eighth grade, I didn't have an Xbox. That was the beginning of eighth grade. I was grounded all eighth grade from, a uh, Xbox. And, like, halfway through my eighth grade year, I got a PlayStation 3. Which I'm selling that to. I'm trying to get a PS4. In the middle of me making this video, I got freaking sponsored. So, you know, I kind of have to put this in this video. Because I am freaking excited that I'm finally freaking sponsored. Oh, my God. Um, if you guys want to check them out, they'll be in the link in the description below. They're freaking awesome. They're no-scope glasses. They're to help your eyes from being strained. And if you play games all the way up to you go to bed, wear them. I put them on two hours before you go, before you get, go to bed or whatever, and it, it'll tell something in your brain that it's, that it's actually going night, like, the UV ray will bounce off of it, and your brain will see that still going nighttime, so you'll be able to sleep better and won't have insomnia and stuff, cause that's what I do, so, I'm getting a pair myself, um, I, they're, hmm, how am I gonna do this part? Uh, if you click the link in the description below and you order a pair through my link, you'll get 5% off and I will receive 5%. I'm not going to be a sellout. Trust me, I'm not like that. I'm just, I'll wear them every once in a while. Not going to sell them out. Not like that. Anyways, guys, I've been Trey Face. Mm -hmm. here. Now you get to go. Go. Peace, guys.